Good evening, morning, where, whatever time it may be, fans of Aurora Shock Media. This is your favorite Transformer, Decepticon Jr., or Decon as I like to be called. And I am doing a, what do you think? A Transformers video review. Now, this right here, this right here we have Transformers, Robots in Disguise, Leader Class, Ultra Magnus. Now, this is a beautiful figure. One of my favorites. I have been dying to get my hands on him, and I, and I finally did. As you can see, we have, in the background right here, Optimus Prime's arm. That's Revenge of the Fallen Optimus Prime. Say hello, Optimus Prime. Or don't, like anybody freaking cares. This isn't your spotlight! Alright, back to the video. As you can see, this is a very, very good figure. I mean, rubber tires, good articulation. Well, at least in the in the wrists, in the in the hands, the arms they rotate, hundred like three sixties. The legs go out, they bend. If I can do this without breaking it, there we go. Fix it back. There we go. And he just got closer to the camera. Nice. Piggy wants to ho hog the camera, doesn't he? Hog it, Pig. Does the starlight feel good? Alright, on to the transformation. Let's see if I can do this. Alright, so you pick him up, like so, and you remove his legs. And that's it for now. Anyways, alright. We'll put his leg there. Move this tab down. Flip this part around. And bring this up. Now these joints right here, these joints they like to come uneven, so you gotta be careful. And this part right here, we reconnect. So we're going from this to this. So anyway, we're gonna put that down. The same thing with this. Fix these edges and strain that out. Now then, we are going to connect these figures like so. Ah, if I can do it. There we go. And here we have the back of Ultra Magnus's trailer. So we're going to put that over here. And here we have Ultra Magnus's torso. So what we need to do is flip this upward. That's what I do in order to put these legs the leg joints back up. Now I have found that these joints are extremely tight. Oops. The thing popped out. Now I have found that these leg joints are extremely tight in some in some figures. But you know with a little bit of elbow grease and a bit of TLC, you can loosen it up to, so that it, it, it flies just like these arm joints. 
Now then, you put both arm joints up. Twist his hand down so it's facing the wheels. Oh, too much light. And you can see my other figure, R.I.D. Optimus Prime, which I will be doing a review of next video. But in the meantime, in the meantime, we twist this arm up, twist it that way, move the hand so that it's down. And I really apologize for the crappy camera angle. But this is the only way I can do it. So make sure the arms are like this. Oh god. I can't believe the way I'm talking. I apologize everybody. Everybody, every pony for the bronies. Oop. Took them off camera for a minute. Uh, and you're going to flip this over. Make sure these connect. And make sure these are in the right holes. And that way he rolls. Oh, I almost forgot this. Now then, to connect his trailer. Just back it in like that and tab it into these holes like that. And bring this back. Come on. And there you have Robots in Disguise Leader Class Ultra Magnus. Now, indeed, he rolls pretty well. I haven't seen any any cracks in the tires yet. He is a fairly good, a very, no, screw fairly. He is an extremely good figure to buy. I would, I really recommend this figure. So, like I said, next video, Robots in the Skies, Leader Class Optimus Prime, the brother of Ultra Magnus.